Okay, my hair is actually not that unruly. Hey guys, what's up? It's Nadia here back with another video for you. If you guys have seen my last video, you guys know that my hair underwent a very damaging process and it's time to rejuvenate my hair. So as you can see, my hair is very, very lifeless. It's very, very dry. There are probably a ton of split ends. Like it is disgusting. Let me show you the back. Super dry, it tangles very, very often, and it's super overprocessed, okay? I do a lot of hair dyeing videos and I dye my hair quite a lot. And I guess this time I'm really paying for it. Is my hair due for a trim? Absolutely. Am I probably going to get a trim? I don't know yet. I have never done a protein treatment before and my hair severely, severely needs it. And this is how you can tell your hair severely needs it. Your hair absorbs every single liquid that you put in it. If you are washing your hair and then squeezing the water out and it feels like you're squeezing that water out forever, you have high porosity. If you are drying your hair and you feel like it takes ages to dry, that's not normal. That means you have high porosity. If you are constantly dyeing your hair like me and you've never done a protein treatment, Chances are you need one. My hair gets super tangled, super fast. The ends are unbearable, especially when I'm drying my hair. It just gets caught in everything. My hair is not fried, okay? So please stop saying that. My hair is not fried. It just needs a little love and some support and probably not to be touched for a very long time. I'm going to be trying the Affigy two-step protein treatment. You can get this at Sally's, Amazon, Target. Looks like this for you. I just got the little like one-use pack because I think it'll be enough to cover my hair. It comes with the step one and the step two. The step two is just kind of like a deep conditioner. Apparently this stuff is super freaking liquidy. So I went to the dollar store and I bought a spray bottle and we're gonna spray it into my hair. The first step is just to cleanse and shampoo and make sure that all the buildup is out of your hair. They do sell a specific shampoo that you can use, but I'm just gonna use a clarifying shampoo and then my regular bonding shampoo and go from there. I'm excited, I have never done this before. I'm excited to see the results. I've heard really, 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 really great things. And yeah, I'm gonna go shampoo my hair. I'll be back, bye. So I'm back. So I just shampooed my hair and I just want you guys to take a look. Take a look. First of all, look how thin it got. Like, I have four strands of hair on my head, but I haven't brushed through it yet. But do you just see how stringy it looks and how gross it looks? Let me show you the back. Just very stringy and uh, not that healthy looking. I'm going to brush this out. Okay, perfect. Separate these two. I'm just gonna pour this into here. Oof. Yeah. Mm. People say it smells that, but I don't think it smells that bad. Ugh, I got some of it on my hand and it is so sticky. What the? Okay. <laughs> I'm just gonna spray it on. Ugh, that went all over my neck, hold on. I think it went in my mouth. Okay, it kind of does smell bad. Ah! That went right in my ear. I'm gonna comb it through. The wide tooth comb. Comb it through. And then you actually want to blow dry this in. Medium heat, high airflow. Okay, I am done blow drying, finally. Okay, that did take quite a bit because my hair, like I said, does not like to dry. My hair is now crispy, crispy. You're not supposed to brush through it. You're not supposed to comb through it. Please do not do that. With protein in your hair, you will break your hair off, literally. So please don't do that. You're not supposed to agitate your hair at all. But yeah, it is crispy. It did exactly what it said it was going to do. And now I'm just going to wash it out and use the balancing moisturizer. You're supposed to rinse with warm water and then proceed with the balancing moisturizer and then leave this on for two minutes. That's exactly what I'm going to do. In the shower while I am doing other shower duties. But yeah, I will be back to show you what my hair looks like wet and what it looks like dry. Wish me luck. See you in a jiffy. 
I'm back. This is my hair out of the shower. I used the balancing moisturizer. I haven't combed through it yet, so this is just how it looks like straight out of the shower. I am obsessed. My hair, when I was washing it out, has not felt like this. I can't even remember when. It just feels so good. The true test is when it's going to be all blow dried and we can actually see the final results and I can show you and tell you how it feels. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that, put some heat protectant in and I'll be back. So here are the finished results of my hair. I am quite honestly amazed at how well this product worked. My hair feels so much better. Obviously, it could probably still use a little trim for my dry ends, but overall, my hair feels absolutely amazing. It was such a breeze blow drying it. It used to take me like half an hour to 45 minutes to blow dry and it only took me 15 minutes. It didn't tangle. It just went straight through the brush. I am obsessed. I'm going to show you the back just in case you're interested. I didn't curl it or anything because I just wanted to show you guys what it would look like straight after blow drying. If you guys are interested in doing a protein treatment, I will have the link to the one that I did down below. Please do not overdo it. Protein treatments can severely damage and break off your hair if you do them often due to a protein overload. This is exactly what my hair needed. Anyways, that was all for this video. Let me know if you guys enjoyed it. Let me know if you are interested in trying a protein treatment and let me know what other videos you want to see from me. I love you guys so, 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 so much much and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye!